I'm currently in the process of updating my creative brand, where I do graphic design, logo, and brand work for my clients. It started off with a few projects for friends and family, but I was able to showcase that work and land myself some new clients with local small businesses and startups. And with this continued success, it's given me inspiration to update my own brand, including things like new business cards, a new website, but most importantly, my mission. What do I aim to achieve through these services? And what unique value am I adding for my clients? As I was pondering these things, an aspect of my life that really seemed to click with this mission was my daily habit of drinking matcha, which I've been doing for the better part of about two years now. And while I've enjoyed the occasional matcha latte, pretty much my entire life. It wasn't until recently that I started learning more about this beverage and its unique tradition. The matcha, or tea ceremony, seeks to create and promote a positive relationship between host and guest. And this is done through a careful and intentional process of presenting the tools and preparing the tea. All these tools have a unique and significant purpose in the matcha preparation. There are many small steps that are performed in a very specific order. The greeting, the purification and presentation of clean teaware, prepping and preheating the tea bowl, prepare, sift, and scoop the matcha, ladle the water, whisk, and then drink. Now, this all seems a bit laborious for something we can just microwave and add a tea bag to, right? But there's so much more going on here than just a cup of tea. There's a careful process at play. All the tools are chosen for their unique and specific role, all interweaving to create not just a cup of tea, but a thoughtful, an engaging experience for the host and guest. Now, I'm no tea master, and I don't go through this full process for my daily cup, but I do like to take my time and use the preparation as a sort of meditative experience. It's how I start my day, and regardless of how busy I am, I always make sure to take my time to prepare my morning matcha. And as this relates to my creative brand, I wanna convey that same message, using specific and thoughtful tools to create not just the product, but a unique experience and relationship between myself and the client. Now talking matcha again, do you have a similar meditative process in your daily routine? Maybe it's your morning coffee or taking time and careful consideration when you make your breakfast or dinner every day. Or maybe it's another daily practice like reading or walking. Have you had a similar experience where something you thought was relatively routine actually has a more elaborate and deeper meaning? I'd love to hear your stories and practices that you take the time for. Always remember, no matter where you are, we're all living some type life. Later.